Det har jeg gjort det før, men å gå med en warmachine rundt igjen. <laughs> da kan man ikke skyte, men uh, det er såpass krise at det er... Hva tenkte jeg med det? This is a ninth age battle between highborn elves and orc goblins again. It's a refused flank and a breakthrough objective. We just, before moving anything, gave the world prize in bad deployment to this bolt rover, <laughs> which is behind the fountain. <laughs> Basically a hard cover at anything you choose at. <laughs> After the first round, the High Elves loosened fire against the 45 strong Goblin unit with the General and Shaman, and they were reduced after magic and fire to just 7 Goblins left. They fled and did not manage their panic test in subsequent round, so they're still fleeing on a half leadership, which is fine. They have the BSB within 12, but they'll have to manage the 5 leadership on two attempts next round. Goblins advance, and the Prince on a Dragon advances. <coughs> the Doom Diver shoots down two Alirian Rivers. On Highborn Elves turn 2, they move forwards again, threatening the goblins. They shoot away a couple of goblins here and there, and a Nash Wrecking team, and that's pretty much that. The Highborn Elves have very effective magic. After Highborn Elves turn 2, <laughs> Many things take wounds from the magic and shooting. One scrap wagon falls. The elves line up for battle. The dragon charges the trolls. And we'll see how the end of turn two winds up. Sorry again, we're now at turn 3. And this is the bottom of turn 3, that is the Orc and Goblin's turn. They've taken two more wounds of the dragon, so he has four <laughs> left. I get two with here. <laughs> I get. We're just playing here. Uh, the dragon lost combat by four and ma just manage its leadership exactly, so it did not flee its stock. The Swordmasters killed the giant, that was the only charge that succeeded. The two other charging units, the Squigs and the other gi giant, failed the charge. But the Scrap Wagon and the Boar Boys destroyed three Align Rivers. And the Grotlings kill the Bolt Rover. So now it's Highborn Elf's turn 4. Det er helt sikker på, når vi har spilt i snart 10 timer, så det er så, er, er så mye erfaringsgrunnlag for å si at dette er tur 4. Ja, tur 4, ja. Ja, ja du, du sa turn, tror du sa tur 3. Akkurat, vi må bare huske bedre. Mm -hmm. Vi vet jo hvilken tur det er. Mm -hmm. After turn 4, the trolls are still in combat with the dragon, who has three wounds left. These units have released three fanatics through the combat. The shaman and goblin king are left alone after they miscast a spell and immolated the rest of the goblin unit. The Swordmasters finally killed the giant and reformed. They're now charging the Boar Boys. 
as are the silver arms. These fled from the combat with the dragon. The highborn dragon pursued down the last trolls off the table with two wounds left itself. The shaman was shot down by magic and arrows and the goblin king lost one wound. The swordmasters killed five boar boys together with the silverham cavalry and the cavalry pursued or overran. And that's that. The battle ended with uh, a lot of dice left on the table. The prince on the dragon did not die, neither did the goblin king, but most of the goblin king's army, including the shaman. There were no units in the enemy deployment zones, but it was probably a 20-0 battle anyway with a difference of about 4,000 points maybe